None other than Ryan Bader, uh, Bellator heavyweight champion of the world, Bellator light heavyweight champion of the world. Um, I mean, you've had a, quite a year this last year, year and a half. So, uh, and so explain to me, because it kind of looked like things were going a different direction and all of a sudden, phew, yeah. you're, you're right at the top of the, of, the, of the mountain. Explain to me how this took place and how we got to this point. Yeah, you know, I have 20 fights in UFC, and it came down to uh, my contract was about to come up, and usually they sign you with one fight left. So yeah. they came to us and like, hey, you got to resign. I'm like, hey, we're going we're gonna to fight it out. We're going to test the waters a little bit. Mm. And we're talking to Bellator, um, ended up getting a great deal. And I thought, you know what, I'm going to take a chance. I'm going to take this jump. Mm -hmm. You know, I've, I've known one thing for my whole life, yeah. but I, I'm ready for some, something new. And so went over to Bellator was able to fight for a title in Madison Square Garden, my first uh, my first fight. Won that, defended it, got asked to do the heavyweight Grand Prix for to crown the heavyweight champion. Mm. Um, went through that and ended up fighting, uh, you know, pretty much everybody's idol in, in MMA, Fedor sure. Emelianenko. Yep. Yep. Um, ended up beating him in 35 seconds and in, in, uh, rolling from there. And so it's just been one of those kind of roller coasters where, you know, a lot of people were like, oh, left the UFC, won't work out. Yep. You know, I, I feel it's it's been a, one of the best decisions I've made in my career by, by, by far. A lot of people counted you out. Uh, a lot of people thought that you were done. A lot of yeah. people said a lot of shit. Yeah. Um, and all of a sudden, you just came and you just took over a whole different uh, situation with Bellator. And, and now here you are holding two belts. How do you decide um, who you're going to fight next? Because you have you, you, got, you got guys mm -hmm. chopping at the bits at, at, at 205. Then you got guys chopping at the bits at heavyweight. Yeah. How are you deciding? Are you gonna stay? Are you gonna defend your heavyweight belt? Are you gonna defend your light heavyweight belt? How are you deciding which one goes with? Yeah, I realized when I became champion, even in light heavyweight, that you know you have you have a target on your back, right? Yeah. And now when you have two belts, it's it's double. Yeah, for right. Sure. And so I, I'm honestly I'm doing whatever Bellator tells me to do okay. here. You know, I, I have some leeway, like hey, you know when, where, whatever. But after I, I beat Fedor, and I thought I was gonna go back down, they said, hey, will you fight? And one more time at heavyweight yeah. and defend the heavyweight title. I said, "All right, let's do it." You yeah. know, so it's not like I'm holding anything up at all. I'm doing what Bellator tells me to do. You know, and then um, for me, it, I kind of went to them and said, "Hey, I need to go back down to 205. Yeah. I don't want to keep them any longer, and I don't want to have them. Uh, you know, if I'm not going to fight down there, I'd rather re relinquish the belt and then try to come back and win that if I wanted to. Mm -hmm. But I'm jumping back and forth, and, and I want to jump back and forth. I want to be the guy that's constantly defending these titles. So and you have all intentions to continue to go up and down between 205 and, and, and heavyweight? I do. It's, it's not a huge weight issue for me. Mm -hmm. Like 230 right now, I can gain or lose you know, 10 pounds, and I'm right there. Yeah, for so sure. So for me, it, it's nothing, um, it, and I enjoy that. I enjoy it. It's different approaches. You know, heavyweight, I'm the faster guy with good cardio, yeah. you know, and then going back down, I need to be fast, I need to be strong. agile, mm -hmm. I still need to be strong, I need to be, you know, cardio on point, so, and I like those challenges. Are you, um, right now, I consider you the best two-weight guy in between all of one championship, um, Bellator, uh, UFC, I consider you the best guy in that. Um, do you have any intentions to finally get one because you and D dc owes you one yeah dc owes you one yeah he definitely owes you one you know what i'm saying and i don't i don't i don't know man do, do you still like look at those guys and you know say what's going on i would love to do some cross promotion stuff like that yeah. i'm happy where i'm at in bellator extremely happy so if, if at some point that you know we could all come together for fans and i know people want to see that you yeah. know um i, I think dc's done as yeah. far as like he's fighting stipe or or stipe doesn't give him that match you know and that's one that i wish i would have have gone. We were scheduled to fight at some yeah, point. Yeah, I remember. You know? um, so definitely wish, you know, we could do some cross-promotion stuff like that, but I can only control what I, I can control, right? Yeah. And so it's one of those things where I'm happy, super happy where I'm at. Yeah. I'm fighting top level competition. If that never happens, there's no regrets. When, um, when are you looking to get back in there uh, this year? Here? I'm fighting May 9th on Paramount. I'm fighting uh, Vadim Nemkov. He's beat four Russian, four, Rus Russian dude. Yeah. Um, you may not know him, but he's been, he's a beast, you know, yeah. and, and uh, he's definitely deserving of a shot. Well, we're 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 in Miami right now. It's Super Bowl week. Uh, you got to tell me your pick. I got KC. You know, I think <laughs> uh, I think they uh, can run that score up. You know, I think they can uh, at any, any moment they they can either come back or you know start getting uh, uh, moving away in that score. So yeah. that's who I'm going with. Are we, are we taking the bet on that or what? Are you San Fran right now? Yeah, yeah, yeah okay. right now. It may change by Saturday. Let's, Who knows? Let's do it. <laughs> well, right, well. Hey, I'll Venmo you hundred bucks. Let's go. Hey, we'll do this deal. Well, right we here. shall see each other again. Let's uh, go. Signing off with the champion, Ryan Bader, baby. 
What's up, sports fans? Breon Page here with Fanatics Viewed. Thank you so much for hanging out with us. If you enjoyed watching and you want to see more content, subscribe down below.